Hi, this is a quick tour, and uh, as we come into the uh, RV, we have hard wood pergo floors. We also have a full-size refrigerator, which is uh, very nice for a family of four, and freezer. And uh, now we're looking at uh, the stove, microwave, ample cabinets to uh, put dishes and pots and pans down below full-size sink mind you it is still in the cleaning process right now they're cleaning it right now because they had renters in here before and so all the heat ducts you know come up from uh, from uh, the I'm sorry if I cut off there <clears throat> the heat is uh, comes either through electric or propane which can be easily accessible you know as far as uh, putting in uh, propane tanks uh, it does split apart so there's a hydraulic uh, pump inside that uh, will actually move the RV out so that it's wider and so then this couch over here that's a full-size queen bed uh, kitchen table ample room and lots of cabinet space you know for different pots and pans you know whatever one needs very deep cupboards and so let me come over here into the living room and uh, of course for the for the TV and and whatever could be put in this area not necessarily the chair but quite a bit of room and uh, easily you know people be able to live in this you know a family of four very easily for for many years now going into the bathroom real quick we got a full-size shower walk-in shower a beautiful sink regular size sink um, just to open up real quick here here's the shower And then we have a private bathroom, you know, for when whoever is in here needing to get ready for work or whatever, and someone else can use the bathroom. More covered space for linens and towels and things like that. And what we have down here is a full-size dryer and washer. It's all one unit. And that's actually a very nice uh, addition as we spend probably you know at least fifty fifty dollars a month on laundry you know at the laundry mat they're about seven dollars a load and then we get back here and there is a full-size queen bed beautiful queen bed another desk area you know for perhaps the computer being back here and more cabinet space it's a little hard to see but full walk-in uh, closets, very spacious, very spacious. I, I know it's a little hard to see. But uh, here's the mirror, big mirror. And this side also extends out. Um, I don't know if you can see over here, but that extends out farther too. You know, to give more space for the bed. And a nice Swedish mattress. <clears throat> and let's see here. Uh -oh. Over here, they're still in the process of cleaning right now. But anyway, to give a bird's eye view of coming out here into the main room, as you can see, there's quite a bit of space. Perfect for you know the kids doing their homework or having dinner, or whatnot. And then I'm gonna walk outside real quick and just kind of give a brief bird's eye view of the outside <clears throat> and so what we have here is a very very sound RV it's not like the other tin can RVs this is built uh, you know a fiberglass that is very strong same with the roof <clears throat> by the way it comes with an air conditioning as well 
and the roof is very you know it's hard you know it's not like the tin can uh, RVs that are so uh, you know a lot of the older RVs lots of storage space you know for different uh, things that one might need for the house um, a very nice setup and uh, it is towed by a uh, the hitch here it's a little dirty but that's okay and another nice feature about it is it's already hooked in to the septic whereas we have to dump our own septic by ourselves this is what it looks like when the wall is extended out as you can see the hydraulic uh, um, pump that pushes it out <clears throat> it's got its own water supply back here and so this is a very nice RV that will last for a very long time for many 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 years so there you go there's our tour thank you